What's up y'all, it's Alfred and I am back with another hair vlog. So right now I am at Sally's Beauty and today I am gonna be dyeing another bob wig even though I just did a bob tutorial and I didn't like it at all. Like honestly, I didn't really like the shit at all. But I'm gonna try it again, but this time I have a 13 by six bob frontal wig. So hopefully everything goes well with that because I like the deep parting space on a 13 by six wig rather than like a 13 by four. So I'm excited to try this wig and I'm gonna dye it like a baby blue color. So hopefully that is cute. So yeah, I'm about to go into Sally's Beauty and let's see what we could find, bitch. All right, y'all, so I didn't vlog inside of Sally's because the manager was like right in the same aisle as me. And I'm honestly too much of a bitch to, um, to bust out my camera and start talking in a vlog just yet. I have to get a little bit more comfortable, you know what I mean? Now I'm just sitting in the car. I'm about to go to Starbucks to upload my Bob video, the cutting my Bob with a blindfold video. I'm about to go to Starbucks to upload that video because y'all already know. Some of y'all might not know, but I always go to Starbucks to upload my videos because my Wi-Fi is trash, bitch. I have DirecTV and my granddad don't believe in upgrading the Wi-Fi. For some odd reason, I'd be like, Please upgrade the Wi-Fi so I do not have to go out of my way to upload a video. I don't mind it because I just be, you know, chilling anyway and it'd be a comfortable environment. But I just be like, I would love to just sit in a bed and upload a video and just be cool like that. You know what I mean? So anyway, the color that I got is the Ion Color Brilliance in Azure. It's just like a baby blue color. So I'm just gonna put this on the roots so that the roots can be, you know, bright. Because you know, sometimes when you're watercoloring wigs, the roots don't really be that pigmented. It doesn't really latch on to the roots like that. So I'm just gonna make sure that doesn't happen by applying this color. And I'm also gonna go to another beauty supply store around my house when I get back from editing a video to get um, some Adore dyes because I'm gonna watercolor with Adore dyes. So I will talk to y'all. Cool. All right guys, so I made it home. I just got done eating. So I went to this place called Hot and Juicy Crab. It's basically like a little seafood boil you place. Have like crispy shrimp and popcorn shrimp and fried calamari and stuff like that as well. So I just got some takeout of some popcorn shrimp. I didn't eat it all because they gave me a lot better. But bitch, for $10, you better have gave me enough that I could use for a second meal, okay? And I just got me some Cajun fries as well. So now that I am done eating, Zion and Destiny, I think we're supposed to be going back to the same restaurant <laughs> because they want to get some seafood for you. But I'm not going to get anything. I'm just going to chill with them and I'm just going to, you know, go out with them. But I'm not going to get anything because I just ate. So <clears throat> I don't know what time that is supposed to be, low key. Yeah, I am about to go ahead and start dyeing the wig and getting all that shit together. Oh my God. Uh, I forgot to get the fucking dye. Bitch, I forgot to get the dye, oh my god. Okay, well, I have to go back out and get that hair dye. But let me show you all the wig right here. So the wig that I am going to be using in today's video is from Tanache Hair, and this is what it comes with. It comes with like a little carrying bag and all of that, cute, cute, cute. And this is the wig right here. As you can see, it's a 13 by six bob wig, 14 inches. And hopefully, I'm praying this looks better, like I said early in the vlog. I hope this looks better than what I've been getting because, but let me put it on real quick so you all can actually see it. And I think I'm gonna cut this one like very, very, very short, like short as hell. And I might do a little side part or like a little flip over like this. I think I'm gonna do something like that. Okay, yeah, I might just do like a little flip over like this. I feel like a side part. Oh yeah, side part would look way much better. Mm, this is actually cute as fuck. Okay, yeah, blonde. Do I just want to keep it blonde? I kind of don't even want to dye it blue. I kind of would just want to do like a little whatchamacallit blonde. Oh, what if I did the little blonde streaks? I might do that y'all in a bob wig though and just have the blonde streaks like right here like in the front and on the side and stuff like that i might do that because that's cute this bob wig is cute as fuck though y'all okay tanache 
Shake bitch. And y'all, the lace also comes pre-plucked and stuff. So that's cute, but I'm obviously gonna go in and pluck it some more, just because I wanted to look as realistic as possible. So I don't know what time we supposed to be going out low key, so. I don't want to start on this wig and then they text me and be like, is you ready to go? This tripod, oh my God, I need to get a new one. Cause sis, what's going on? Girl. I don't know what I want to do first though, y'all. I don't know if I want to go ahead and cut the bob and do all of that shit first, or do I want to go ahead and dye it first and then dry it, blow dry it, and then, you know, style it and stuff like that and put it on and stuff. I don't really know. All right, y'all, so I actually lie. I am gonna do the baby blue color only because I really want to do something different and you know, I already have a blonde wig, but I'm not gonna just um, watercolor it like I said earlier. I'm gonna try to dye it with a spray bottle because that just sounds so much more efficient and you know, I just wanna see if it will work, but I'm still gonna do the platinum or the blonde streaks in the hair. I'm just gonna cover those with Vaseline and everything like that. But I'm gonna dye it with the spray bottle and I'm still gonna use the um, Ion Color Brilliance. And I'm about to go to the beauty supply store and I'm about to go get a spray bottle so that I can go ahead and dye this wig. I called Destiny and her ass was about to get in the bathtub. So I'm like, okay, I have enough time. This bitch already lives an hour away. <laughs> so I was like, okay, I have enough time to do what I have to do with this wig. We're probably not gonna go out until like nine o'clock or something like that or eight o'clock whenever she gets out to the city because right now now it's like six o'clock. So yeah, I have enough time to do this wig. So I'm about to go to the beauty supply store and get all of my supplies. And I will talk to y'all when I make it back. Okay, y'all, I'm back from the beauty supply store. And the first color I got was the Adore Sky Blue. And then the second one I got was the Adore um, Periwinkle. I wish this would focus. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. Yeah, and Periwinkle. And I got these two little spray bottles. It's just like regular ass spray bottles. Just a little generic ones. I need to find me like a little ghetto cheap little beauty supply store when I get to LA because I don't have time to be going to Target and shit. Paying like, if I would've went to Target, this shit would've been like, these would've been like $8 or some shit, but these was like a dollar. So yeah, I got these little spray bottles just so I could spray it. And I'm actually gonna do two colors, hence why I got two colors. So I'm gonna do sky blue and I'm gonna do periwinkle and I'm just gonna, you know, switch off. I'm gonna use both hands and I'm just gonna, you know, dye it. We just gonna hope for the best, bitch. Well, you will see what I'm doing. I don't, I don't know what I plan on doing. Uh, at this point, I'm just doing some shit. But I'm still gonna go ahead and use this Ion Color Brilliance and put this on the parts and the hairline and stuff. So let's get to dying, bitch. Okay, so now y'all, I'm about to go ahead and protect the lace with some Vaseline. Okay. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and part the little blind pieces that I wanna make blind. So I guess I'm gonna do like this little piece. I'm just literally gonna take random little pieces. Like literally random little pieces. And just take them. Alright, so now I have my color right here, and I'm just gonna take it in this bow. I hope this doesn't really affect it, this red in here. Oh well. I'm just gonna take it in this bow. Oh, it's white. Okay. Mix it with a 30 volume developer instead because this is all I have. So, it's one in one parts, so I'm just gonna match it up like that.
All right, y'all, so I have my water in here. Now what I'm gonna go ahead and do is just put a little dye in each of them. So this is the periwinkle color. Gonna... That's as much. I don't really know how much I just put in there, low key. Let's see. We're gonna see how opaque it is, and that should determine how much I put in there. These are my two dyes right here. Let me pop on my gloves and let's get to spraying. I really hope this comes out right, y'all. If it don't come out right, I'll just literally watercolor it, but you know, I just wanna try. I'm gonna start going right here. But I need some more dyes. So that's doing a little something. You can see it's doing a little something, something. But I'm gonna put some more dye in it so that it could be more opaque. That's better. This is taking too damn long, but jump in the water, tell us some hell. I just wanted to see what it was gonna do, and obviously this shit just take too long, so this won't be happening. So this won't be working, but let me see if I spray both of them at the same time. It's kind of cute, whatever. Yeah, um, whatever. Let me get a thumbnail, bitch. Just gonna go ahead and watercolor the hair downstairs in my basement because this is taking too damn long and I don't have time for it, bitch. I don't got time for that shit. But good morning, y'all. It is day two of me dyeing this wig. Yesterday, y'all already know I started like later in the day, so I didn't really get to catch the sunlight. And for this wig, I really want to take sunlight pictures in front of my window because it is a colored wig. So I went ahead and dyed the wig yesterday. I went ahead and watercolored it just with the sky blue color and a little bit of the periwinkle color and a bucket of water. And then these are the little white streaks, as you can see on the top. The little white streaks are there. Mm -hmm. So now I'm just about to go ahead and start cutting the hair, start styling it, and then after that, I'm gonna go ahead and pluck it and stuff. And we're gonna get to installing it. So I'm about to turn on some music because I need to, you know, jam real quick. I need to be in my zone while I'm doing this. So it's not really gonna be a talk through, but I am mean, gonna prop y'all up so y'all can see everything I'm doing. Of course, duh. Get in there, but it's you spinning it. Give a fuck what a nigga got up in giving it. Hey. Badass bitch, bad attitude. Nails done, hair done. And so, he won't answer you, bitch. That's because of me. What? Act up, you can get snatched up.
guys so this is the finished wig after it is styled and everything i just decided to do waves it's kind of i look like the motherfucking wicked witch of the west <laughs> so now that i have the ear tabs cut and the wig is fitting comfortably and everything i'm now about to just go ahead and use a new technique for cutting off my um lace the access lace i was just going to use my little shark teeth scissors but I want to try a new technique with the razor this time. I want to actually go in and customize it like, you know, randomly instead of having like the perfect shark teeth. You know what I mean? Okay, y'all, so I am now done with my makeup. This sunlight is so bright, but this is the bob. This is the completed hairstyle. I hope you all like it. Let me get my ass out of the sun. My lace is dark as hell because I guess this Fenty Beauty um, foundation is darker than my actual skin tone. So I'm just going to have to wash this wig when I take it off. And then when I want to put it back on, I'm just going to have to put a lighter foundation on the cap because as you all can see, it's just a little darker than my actual skin tone but yeah guys this is the end of the video i hope you all enjoyed it if you don't already please do not forget to follow me on my instagram and twitter they are both afalusa third and if you haven't subscribed already sis what you doing oh my tripod y'all already know how that goes sis what you doing what you doing just click the subscribe button come on join the family what you doing come on i want you over here but yeah y'all i'm about to go take some more pictures i love you all so 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 fucking much and i will see you all in my next video <gasps>